Hey crawlers, welcome back to another Minecraft video. Guys, today I have an upgraded version of my tileable automatic sorting unit. Uh, let's just go ahead and call this version 2. Uh, this is made in the snapshot 13w01b. And uh, let's, let's see how it works. If you guys don't remember my old version, the one I made myself, everything, uh, it's this right here. Um, that's where the cart comes in, drags the items out, pushes out, blah, 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 blah. Um, this one is, uh, yeah, four blocks wide. One, two, three, four, five, six blocks high. And, uh, because this is uh, just a chest. That's an input. You can put inputs anywhere. Um, and so, yeah, so it's one, five blocks high, four blocks wide, and infinitely tileable. And uh, not just tileable from left to right. But it's also tileable from front to rear. Now, I'm going to show you guys how this works. Uh, basically, if you guys see my videos already, you already know that we can basically create uh, filters for hoppers. And you do that by placing uh, items in there less than um, 22. And because and 22 will give you a pulse from a uh, comparator. Uh, so at that point... Um, it will it'll give a pulse and then we can power stuff at the end of that pulse obviously But let's check it out uh, Let's let's see. What do I got? I've got iron. So let's go ahead and just throw a stack of iron in there And what's gonna happen here? when it registers over uh, 22 18 19 20 21 22. It's got 22 in there right now It emits a pulse that pulse then comes out powers this uh, piston pushes it down repeater going into this block uh, is powering this piston uh, and pushing up the minecarts. Now, uh, what uh, what's his name? <laughs> um, I'm freaking out on a name right now. Seth Bling came out with a recent version using these pistons, but him he was using pistons and pu being able to somehow push them straight up with a piston instead of a block on top. I couldn't get it. Couldn't get it to work. Uh, so, and uh, my design is actually one wa one block smaller than his design, and it uses a piston uh, with a uh, sticky piston with a block on top of it. So the design is it's much different than his. Uh, however, the the principle of pushing up a uh, uh, minecart uh, is is where I got this design. So, uh, so basically, that's how that works. And then once it goes up, it will take out as many items as it needs until it has less than 22 blocks and then this will turn off and then that will then push put this minecart back down and then I'll take these items push them put them into this right here it'll put them into this block right there now this is where it gets fun guys this is where it gets fun now we already know that it is uh, it is tileable from left to right. You can see it because it's stacked here next to each other. Uh, but let's say, let's say we want, let's say we want items here. Oops, you know what? I have to change that. Uh, let's say we want items down there. Uh, well, let's let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Uh, let's just, you know, say that this is this is tileable this way. Uh, so this is also a tutorial as well guys basically we're gonna recreate this and we're gonna put it right behind it okay so uh, let's go ahead and start here uh, with our hoppers our hoppers are facing down right here so then we grab a hopper hoppers facing down uh, then we have pistons sticky pistons facing up with a block on top we can now break those blocks out we don't need them and behind there, we have two blocks with repeaters facing inward. Okay. Uh, next up is we have uh, some pistons pushing down. So let's go ahead and get the, the blocks up there. That's right here. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, pistons pushing down right here with some redstone blocks at the end of those and on top of these blocks we're gonna have some comparators bam and bam perfect uh, and uh, now we want to put in our hoppers all right so first thing I'm gonna do is place some blocks here and I'm gonna point these hoppers down 
because that's where we're gonna that's where we need them uh, next thing uh, here if you notice that we've got uh, items facing into a chest so just for uh, you know for the sake of repetitiveness I guess uh, let's go ahead and face them into the repeater and then we have this one here now this is not how we want to keep it that is just the design of this of the first one when you're tying in uh, when you're tying in the ones from the front to the ones in the rear you need to you need to have your connections a little bit different so in this case we're actually gonna want to have th this row of stuff go into this row of stuff so what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna have oops I'm gonna have these coming out this way break this up and have this one going in what oh yeah that faced the right way this way the items are going through here just as if they were in water riding up here on top uh, and filtering down below uh, you want it you you have to have a direction so I want it to go from this hopper all the way back here and then into this one so now our chest is going to be moved from that side to this side and then I need to change these coming from that direction so there you have it uh, now we no longer need that uh, our item uh, uh, or our input for our items is right here uh, so now we need to figure out what we want here I'll just put some chests because I have a bunch of them and I'll just make sure I have just enough 17 and uh, this one I will have uh, redstone blocks and we'll put 17 in there as well perfect uh, now here comes the slightly tricky part uh, these carts right here now the way I did this uh, you can do it multiple ways but the way I did it is uh, just put glass panes and then put some carts uh, right there some rails it doesn't matter what kind of rails really uh, but the the trick on this is actually to do it one at a time so hold on uh, minecart rails like that break that up the reason I have to do two like that is to get the direction to face inward now already I could tell you there's a problem because that's that's on but uh, hopefully I don't think it's gonna cause an issue they use glass panes and what that's gonna do that's gonna stop it halfway it's exactly what we want and now I need a minecart go right there and let's push that in there perfect and then to break these out you want to go from underneath not on top they're very difficult to hit from top you can break that out and it sits there just like that if you're facing the other way the other access uh, they these have a tendency to want to fall and then turn in the other direction so they can be difficult you just need to figure out the best way to do that uh, so then I want to do the same thing here Oops, break that out right there and then cart Oop, break that out right there push it perfect break it out and then break out this glass pane and there you go there you have it uh, now the next part um, first first let's just make sure that this works uh, if this works when I put items into this chest uh, let's say the redstone block and the chest these should trigger so again there's still bugs with this so they may they may have issues so uh, it looks like it's working so far items should be flowing into this cart and it looks like that's working just fine and there you go they are moving down into this hopper now we got to get the items from this hopper and you notice that this other one didn't trigger here you notice that that one didn't trigger I bet you our items are right here yep that's a normal chest and that is a normal chest now this is a bug with Minecraft at the moment these don't always work uh, however when when the next uh, when the next updates happen I'm sure that there's going to be a fix for all this stuff uh, sometimes it's an item base but for the most part it's usually Oh, items were going in there. Uh, usually, it's uh, based on the literally the very block, the 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 axis that it sits on. So, like if you're in 
whatever x something and y something that one won't work it's very odd but let's go ahead and put that in there and it looks like that's not working either so again it's 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 that one block now now what we don't want to do uh you know work in progress all that good stuff uh now we want to get that over to here now we can oops we can go like this down and then oh no not that way this way like this whoops go that way and that way now that right there is going to get sucked directly into this one now here is where there's an issue if you were to do this and then line up a row underneath it uh right here with this one all the items are actually going to prioritize to go down and then into this cart so that's a problem so your best bet is to be able to do when you're doing this break out that section and only use uh yeah hold on let me use block here uh only use every other vertical block for your sorting that's going to be your best bet so here you're going to want to do this go this way and this right here will still work because items won't come out this way but just you know we'll we'll do it right like that and i know the redstone works so let's send that block of redstone in there let's take a look at it and you know what for the heck of it why don't we just go ahead and throw some iron in there i don't know what else we got in here we had some iron and some diamond let's go throw some diamond in there and we don't need full stacks, so I'll just take that out. And, uh, you know, for the heck of it, why don't we just throw some other stuff in there? Some random, random stuff. See where they end up. Let's see what happens. So everything that is not, quote unquote, in the sortable, uh, in the sortable section should be going into this random stuff. And that diamond. Was there no diamond? Oop. That's not good. That means the diamond one didn't work. See, it's very it's very finicky at the moment. Oh, whoa. Whoa, that one came up really quick. All right, guys. So I just noticed that when you're using the lock chests, uh, they emit an electrical current uh, or a redstone current. Um, and you, since you got this thing right here, it's going to cause a bit of an issue. So my, my suggestion for that is to move this out by one more. And you can do that by uh, placing your chest out like this, like this, and like that. No, trap chest. Thank you. Moving them out like this. Taking your. Oh, no, you want to go into the chest. So into the chest like so. There you have it. All right, guys. Uh, I hope you guys. Uh, I hope I explained this well enough for everyone. Uh, but there it is. Uh, there is the Tileable Automatic Sorting Unit Version Two. Hope you guys like it. If you guys did like it, please, uh, you know, rate, comment, subscribe, all that good shit. And uh, as always, guys, keep crawling. And.